Yo, what's up, guys, and welcome to the Gone progression in Deep Book. Okay, for those of you that don't know, Gone is a character from Hunter x Hunter, one of the best animes of all time. Okay, without a doubt. And I have made a build for this character that literally fits him so perfectly. Okay, we got rock, we got paper, we got scissors, and we're gonna be progressing one of the best builds for Gone's character. You know. I haven't done a progression in a while, so I wanted to, you know, kick it back up with a fun progression, something I would actually enjoy making, instead of, like, making a progression on, like, the new legendary weapon. You yeah, know, that's pretty boring. I don't want to do that. Instead, let me do what I want to do, you know? So, um, let's start heading to trial one, and I'll start explaining my vision for the Gone build, okay? So, let's switch to depart. There we go, we're at Loricia. And basically, guys, as you guys know, um, Gone has rock, paper, scissors, except he also has, like, this power up. Or not really power up, but like his final stand, um, where he's at the brink and he uses up all of his like nen. Well, we're gonna be replicating that in Deep Book, okay? Um, let me just sail to Minitrice real quick and go to trial one, and I'll explain literally everything about the build, right? Um, this is a progression I've been wanting to make, literally just for fun, not even for content, because I think the concept is pretty sick. We do have a green Deep Book and Cloak that we're supposed to be equipped right now, but I don't want to lose it in trial one, so we'll get the Gone Drip soon after trial one trust me boys okay just trust the process and uh yeah i'm very excited to progress this character all right guys uh we are at minitresa uh let's just run on over to the trial one real quick let's go ahead and run there real fast as you guys can see i have 20 investment points now uh in order for this build to work it's very um you know min max because there's a lot of cool like synergies and like just cool abilities that not a lot of you guys know about and it requires a lot of points so i really have to like min max this so that's why you have 20 invest points to 15 starting so yeah we're almost um at trial one all right let's jump down here and let me check these chests for iron stasis yes yes let's go <laughs> we got an iron stasis um i needed this because usually you do like 12 damage without an iron stasis and you do like 13.5 with one it's actually a big increase trust me so let's go inside now all right guys we're here um Boys, I haven't played Deep Booking in like two weeks because I've been busy in real life. I was with Aquafina for like uh, eight days in real life, and I just not, I did not feel like playing Deep Booking <laughs> while I had Aqua at my house, right? I did upload three videos um, while she was here, though. She was just laying down on my bed while I did the videos, and I felt low key bad. Um, anyways, we're back now. So let's get started by putting our points, or actually, let's equip the Iron Stasis first. There we go. Now we're not doing 12 damage. Obviously, Gone would use fists since, bruh, come on, have you even watched the anime? It's a no-brainer. But uh, the first thing we're investing into is we're going to go 20 strength so we can get strong left, okay? Strong left is going to be Gone's uh, rock, obviously. Come on now. So, under the threat of blank, are you able to defend yourself? Yes, I can. Okay, let's do this real quick. There we go. Let's just continue investing into strength. And we won't be able to level up. We'll just have to defeat a Sharko first. So, let's just defeat that. We got the Sharko. And guys so rock is going to be strong left obviously but we're also going to have a empowered strong left so you guys know when he's like in his enraged state where he uses up all his uh his ken or hockey i forgot what it's called whoa that's gonna be sky shower kick uh scissors is actually gonna be scissors literally scissors using a fade trimmer oath i'll explain that more um after i level up here so we have 20 strength now so we'll just go into thunder call for now because we need grand javelin i'll explain why we need grand javelin in a second okay we level it up let's hopefully we have strong left out of this hand let's get uh, blood iron spirit for the plus five hp let's get fishman for those plus five hp as well and strong left perfect okay we got strong left so this is our rock so you know how it's gone gone says rock paper scissors well we have rock and we'll go vitality for now because i'm not trying to be squishy at level eight you know uh let's just keep going thunder call we're gonna be we're gonna stop going to thunder call at 50 thunder call it is a pretty unique build guys and you guys are gonna see it's gonna all like come together this build does require a lot of ether because it is a little bit mantra spammy but it'll make sense once you see it right so the oath is fate trimmer and we're gonna be using uh two moves out of the fate trimmer set the the close shave and also the precision cuts because i mean literally bruh it's literally scissors it's quite literally perfect for going right uh we defeat the golem let's just keep going to thunder call all right there we go let's see what we get now all right now you guys may be wondering why are we investing into thunder call well uh our paper is actually going to be grand javelin grand javelin is like a perfect paper since it's like a range like he's balling up his fist and putting it out for like the range attack just like the anime right and then we're also getting lightning cloak so when Ra when gone or gone guys forgive me if i say gone okay when Gon goes into the rage mode, he's like empowered, empowered by his demons. 
and that's like he just gets significantly stronger which i feel like lightning cloak definitely does because lightning cloak bro i get scared you could be a bot but you pop lightning cloak i will be scared of you no matter what regardless right so lightning cloak is just really really scary to fight against which is perfect for going right we got loot skipper so let's burn that we do not want that but we got replenishing knockout so let's get that of course that is really good for us and let's see uh we'll get triathlete just in case people want to run from us and for our final talent we can get mm, uh i mean concussive force is pretty good since we're gonna be boss raiding a lot uh hopefully i'm not rusty because i haven't played for two weeks like i said but we'll keep going vitality and there we go Let's just keep going to Thundercall until we get 50 Thundercall, and then we'll be chilling. All right, let's see what our next mob is. And you guys may have noticed that we're also Iron Sing, right? What what Iron Sing mantra could possibly be part of Gones or yeah, Gones um, move set or Gons? I forgot how you call his name, but it's actually Metal Fake Out. Metal Fake Out is like the most anime move ever, bro. You literally like teleport to them with no wind up, and you can do like paper or something it's gonna be sick it's really hard to explain now but once i get metal fake out i'll definitely show you guys like my vision it's it's definitely really cool okay metal fake out and also iron skin iron skin is so we can do a transformation uh with with uh barber's skill set i won't spoil it too much now but just know iron skin and this uh build is gonna have a little transformation mode which is gonna be really cool so i'll show it whenever i have it bro can this angel stop holding s against me there we go okay let's grip Okay, there we go. And we're almost at 50 Thunder Call. We leveled up. So hopefully we get Grand Javelin here. But we're not going to get Surge Path Unstable Capacitor. Because when we use Lightning Cloak, that's going to make our aura blue. And Gon actually has a, a yellow aura, right? So we're not doing that. Let's instead get Duelish Dance, which is really, really good. We will also get Jolting Current. Current. And as for the Mantra, please, bruh, we did not get the mantra that we wanted we wanted um grand javelin so we can just roll to this for now let me burn this as well row two okay we got marauder and we also got straddle shock so okay there we go um put our last points in the thunder call and now let's lock this we're not gonna be investing into thunder call no more we have literally everything we want or we don't have the mantras yet that we want but we have like the stat points and now we're just gonna go 30 iron zig that's it just 30 there we go let's see what the next monster is okay enforcer um yeah so i mean Guys, when I say I wanted to progress this build just purely for fun, I wasn't even going to make this a video. I was actually making a Gone build just just, just to have it, not even for a video, which is crazy. I was like, you know what? I think this would be a, a, pretty, a pretty fun progression when I was doing like bounties and I was noticing I was just absolutely destroying people while being literally Gone. So, oh my god, a three-star Enforcer Axe. Oh my god, what the luck? But uh, yeah, I decided to make this a progression, but originally it wasn't supposed to be. Okay, let's keep on iron thing. We leveled up. Let's see what we get. Scuba Drowner for the plus five HP. Yes, please. Uh, let's see. Uh, I guess we can get mm, Gourmet. Sure, why not? Since we have Vegetarian. And perfect. We got Discovery of Flyer, Fire. So guys, Discovery of Fire is actually a part of his moveset. So for those of you that don't know, Discovery of Fire is actually like a combat mantra low key. So I, I, I key bind my 9 key to the E key. So when I'm fighting people, all I have to do is press E and they'll be set on fire if they're close to me. And I think that replicate, and I'm only going to use that. Why is my Roblox VC on? I'm only going to use that when I'm in like Gones rage mode. Okay. So only when he has like lightning cloak active low key. So let's just keep working on getting 30 iron sing. All right. We have the Sand Knight. This guy is going to get knocked pretty easily since we're a fist weapon. And uh, he gets dealt like two times damage to blunt weapons, which is what we are. So the Sand Knight is about... Bro, he's the fire Sand Knight though. He does so much damage. But let's keep attacking, bro. Bah, bah. And there we go. Perfect. The good thing about having it like keybind to E is since they added like the keybind update right here, um, I can still like rest that campfire if there's like an E interact. So it's very like non-intrusive. So boom, we have 30 Iron Sing. We'll lock this now. We're not investing into Iron Sing no more. Let's just invest into strength now. And that's it. We still want to get to 80 strength so we can actually get Sky Shower Kick, which is going to be like the upgraded rock. Um, mm, All these suck. I guess I'll get Condition Swimmer for now. I don't really like picking talents that only benefit you if you got knocked. I guess I'll fold here since those are trash. And, mm, bro, these suck. But we did get one of the mantras that we actually wanted. We, we wanted Iron Skin. So let's burn these two. Let's pick Iron Skin. There we go. We'll put Iron Skin on eight. That's our little transform. I won't spoil why we need Iron Skin right now. But you guys will see why in a little bit. So let's just keep going into Strength. Or let me go into a little bit into Fortitude as well. 
On your toes, lone warrior. Yes, sir. Okay, we spare all this. I go a tiny bit into fortitude, but this is a Shrine of Order build, guys. Like I said, this is pretty min-maxed because it has to be min-maxed to get all the stuff I will actually want for this build, right? So let's get into intuitive repairs. It's pretty good. Now we can repair our armor right now in trial one. It's very nice. We'll also get champion regalia since um, that's just amazing for fist weapons since you literally flourish people all the time. We also got moving fortress. I usually never get this talent until like later on late game. So very nice to have it right now. We also got bulldozer. So I'll take you. There we go. And as for the trait, we'll keep going to vitality, of course. And, uh, alright, I think just the Alpha Sharko now, and then that's literally it, right? Alright, let's beat up the Alpha Sharko real quick. Let's try not to get knocked here, because that's going to be a little sad, but, yeah, he, he got defeated really fast. Let's put the rest of our points into Strength. We need 80 Strength. I'm good on Fortitude for now. I just want one specific talent at 15 Fortitude, but, uh, okay. We're done with Trial 1. 34 Strength, 15 Fortitude, 50 Lightning, and 30 Iron Ting. And we're out of Trial 1. Okay, guys. Before I do some bounties, what I want to do is I want to do the book quest, and I also want to do, like, the steal of book quest. So I want to do two book quests, because I want another mantra. I also want, like, mantra shouting as well. So let me do the Minotaurisa book quest first. Also, let me go get my, my Gone Drip. As I said before, I didn't equip this at the start, because Trial 1 would have took it. But let, let me get dripped out for you guys real quick. Let's get into the cosplay. And boom, we have the Gone Drip. A green cape for now until we're level 10 and then we can actually equip um, the armor that actually makes us look like Gon. I think it's the Verdiant Sniper, right? So there we go. Just real quickly, thank God we got the Iron Stasis from the start because we can't actually loot these chests for some reason. And they only, it's really easy to find them in those chests. So let's go steal the book quest so we can get a ton of aces since we definitely need it to get all the monsters that we want before we try to order. So let me go talk to the guy real quick. All right, let's talk to you. What are you talking about? Bah, bah, bah. Okay, let's go steal the book real quick. I just want the aces, but also the EXP. Like, I'm pretty sure, guys, we're gonna be able to level up if we just complete this quest right here, which is another reason why I'm doing it. And we'll just put it into our dumbbell, right? Because right now it says, I've learned what I can from training, but if we steal this quest and we go back up there real quick. Okay, we're back up. Let's talk to you. There we go. So not only do we have a extra talent from doing that, we also have a lot of extra aces, but we can also level up now because that gave a ton of XP to us. So there we go. We leveled up. Let's see what we get. Okay, we got concussion. I don't actually want concussion. So let's burn this and let's get harsh response instead. Harsh response is probably one of the best talent in the game other than unravering resolve. We got Rooster Spite. I'm taking this. I've learned my lesson from burning it last time. It's a very nice talent to have, obviously. And let's just get Pack Mule for the carry load. And as for the mantra... Oh my god, I don't want any of this. Bro, I did not want any of this. Like, actually, this is this is truly tragic. I think what I'm going to do, guys, is let me burn this stuff right here. Okay, let's get lightning clones. We're not going to use lightning clones. Just hear me out. Let's instead just re-roll this mantra real quick using the, um, the re-roll shrine over here. So if I'm going to do that, let me actually tell Mystic what I want. So I want metal fake out more than anything. So let me tell Mystic I want I what mantras will find me. I seek expert level metal mantras. Hopefully, hopefully we get metal fake out, right? That's what I'm hoping for at least. So let's go to the shrine real quick so we can actually reroll that mantra. We'll have enough uh, knowledge at the end of this to still shrine of order. Don't worry, we have 12 right now and by the end we'll have 15 and that's not including the five that we're about to use to actually shrine of order. I mean, uh, reroll this mantra. So let's just make our way over there real quick. We can just run past these guys that are always chilling and they didn't attack me this time. No, they're they're definitely uh, <laughs> trying to attack me now. But it's fine. We're already long gone. Could you imagine the amount of luck I would have right now if I heard <laughs> Astral Event? You know, despite me getting level 1 Bell, I've actually never had Astral Enchant, you know? Because I didn't care for the Astral Enchant itself. I just only cared for the Bell so I could put on my level 1. And I, like, grinded for, like, two weeks trying to get that. And ultimately, a fan gave it to me. So, shout out to bro. Anyways, we're almost at the Shrine. All right, guys, we're here. Let's just go upstairs real quick and talk to, to the Deep Shrine. And if I don't get Metal Fake out, or if I don't get any mantra that I actually want, because there's a lot. There's Lightning Cloak, there's Grand Javelin, then I'm going to be pretty upset, to be honest. So I wish to engage in a deal, I agree. And let's get rid of Lightning Clones, and let's see what we actually got here. Oh my god, bro. What is a hybrid mantra? What? Like, I don't want that. I don't. Let me take Oxidize and Rush, okay? And let me re-roll that again. Let me just tell Mystic I want another two-star metal mantra, okay? Because I don't know if bro heard me right the first time. But these guys won't leave me alone. I'm trying to get out of combat so I can put down guild base. Chill. All right, let me put down back my guild base. 
There we go. Let's go inside. Okay. Mystic, once again. Oh, no money. I'm broke. Let me sell. Let me sell the three star enforcer racks. Bro, I feel like Mystic shouldn't make you pay money when you have him inside your goad base. I, I literally house you. Where's the rent you pay? Because I know you don't pay no rent, okay? I seek expert level mo mail mantras. Don't screw me over this time, please. And let's try again, boys. One more try. I wish I could get you a deal. Oxidizing rush. Please. Please, man. Oh my god, we got it. We got metal fake out. Thank you. I would have actually cried. So that's going on six. All right, guys. Um, what I'm going to do now is let's go to the void eye now real quick. Let me just run away from the mobs. All right, guys. So I want mantra shouting. But let me rename these mantras real quick to the proper names. So I'm going to name iron skin to transform you guys will see why soon okay i'm not gonna spoil it for now but it's pretty cool but as of right now it's gonna be named transform and we're not gonna use it we're gonna name uh metal fake out to teleport okay so there we go let's put this on six and strong left to rock all right there we go we have our mantras named now i want to get to vigils so i'm actually too lazy to actually sail there so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna take a bounty on someone that's already at vigils and we'll get mantra shouting and we're also gonna get the mantra book quest so yeah let's go ahead and find some bounties all right guys i have a couple bounties at vigils it's two people so let's attack these guys real quick they're healing at a campfire but um all right let's attack these guys it's two people let's this guy's trying to run away, but we can just teleport to bro. So, here, let's just parry this. He has a friend with him. So, I mean, I just want to grip at least one of these guys. Just so we don't get teleported out. And just so we can do the book quest. His friend is... Oh my god, bro. Dude, we're like just piecing bro up. Here, let's... uh, No, we parried this. Okay, let's just do teleport. Boom. Into a uh, strong left. Guys, if I use any like ragdoll move, I combo it into like and i combo it into teleport it's a true combo like if i flourish this guy or if i do strong hold on if i do uh, i'm trying to like showcase like what i'm trying to talk about Dude, ah bro i want him to get hit by the strong left so i could actually like show you guys what i'm talking about but dude this guy's just getting hit by everything but that's fine let's just uh knock these guys real fast so that oh get off me bro why does his critical do a bar i get i'm level eight but that stuff is like genuinely tragic but it's so nice that no matter dude is this is this teammate just gonna win blade from the campfire the entire time i'm like bro what is going on here this guy this guy's not even fighting he's just running the entire time and okay he's running for vision shaper i get it now he has a 20 percent damage reduction and he can't get knocked now but one thing is is if he's like zero percent hp inside the vision shaper room he will, um, he won't get knocked. Wait, I can knock him by doing this. Oh my god, I'm so smart. <laughs> Guys, there's a glitch in the Vision Shaper realm where you can't, you can't, uh, grip someone in the Vision Shaper realm because, uh, they'll stay immortal HP. They'll stay 0% HP until the Vision Shaper realm is, like, done for, right? But if you set them on fire, it'll actually glitch out and still auto-execute them. Oh my god, bro. We just auto-execute, bro, by pressing E and doing discovery of fire. That is actually hilarious. He said what? He said, bro, how? <laughs> Dude, he is so, like, confused right now. How did you insta-grip? Guys, when you use Vision Shaper Realm, he used it when he was low HP so that... Oh my god, he has Black Diver. I'm taking this stuff. He used it so he wouldn't get gripped because um you stay at 0% HP. But since I saw his Immortality Helm proc I knew he was 0% HP. And all I did was set him on fire, and he got instant grip, bro. That was like, oh my god, that was actually perfect. Well, that was a really, like, funny bounty. Um, bro, we're just that powerful as going. One thing I need to keep in mind is I need to, like, just remember to use Discovery of Fire, like, if, while fighting people. Because it's just free damage. Sets them on fire. And you guys just saw, like, what I was able to do with it. That was, like, sick. Now there are vigils. Let's go ahead and get the book quest. And let's also get Mantra Shouting as well. So, yeah, let's do that real fast. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Uh, absolutely. There we go. We got spell shout. So now when we say rock, people are actually going to see... Oh, oh my god, my frames from defeating that table. Okay, now when we use rock, people will see that we're actually using rock. Uh, let's talk to this guy. Do you have any books? There we go. I think now what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the exact same thing I just did for the video thing. But I'm going to take a bounty on someone that's at um, Etrian Wilds. So let me use my Void Eye here. So we set our spawn here. So we don't have to sail back here ever. Let's just go take a bounty on someone that's at uh, Etris now, boys. Also, my food and hunger is pretty low. 
But, bro, I was so smart for that. I'm not going to lie. Okay, we took a silent bounty on someone that's at Etrus. Uh, we don't know where they are since it was silent. They're probably at Nomad Camp, but we don't have to fight them. Because if we fight them, then we would have to use our Void Eye set. Right, so instead, what I'm going to do is pray we don't get teleported out. And we can just run to the uh, quest guy right now. And we're about to speed run the book quest literally super fast. So let's just run down there real quick. Okay, let's talk to you. Who are you? Blah, blah, blah. Let's talk to you. Speed run it. And boom. Perfect. And we didn't get teleported out either. So what we can do now is we can just leave the game and we'll get sent to the void heart. Okay, I logged from the server. So we got sent to the void, uh, void heart. Since we set our spawn at uh, vigils or we didn't, we set our void eyes vigils. We can just talk to void mother. We'll get sent straight back down, which is very, very useful. Okay, let's talk to you. I should depart. And there we go. Okay, that was no small errand. We're hoping for grand javelin or lightning cloak, please. Oh my God, we didn't get, bro, we did not get it at all. Why is keep giving me support mantras? I don't get it. Like, hello? Whatever. Let's get storm blades. Okay. Um, we're not gonna use storm blades, obviously. So what I, I think I'm gonna do is let me go inside my goad base real quick, guys. Oh, I can't construct here where I'm seen as an enemy, so got it. Let me go uh further down real quick. <sighs> I still can't construct construct it. Let me let me let me just look at the real quick. You, you guys will see why. Alright, we're at um Minitresa. Also, oh, I, I I forgot to show you guys fully what Discovery Fire does. It's like I know I, I literally grip someone with it, but literally, if I just press E, right? Like mid mid combo, it'll set okay, he didn't get sound fire, but it'll set whoever's next to me on fire, which is very, very useful. Uh, you know, it just the fire damage is like five damage, which it adds up, it adds up. And then they have to roll, they can't they get rid of roll. But anyways, the reason we're here at Minitresa is because i have two knowledge okay let's go inside our guild base real quick and take out a book you know a special kind of book uh, you know i think going like serene let's go inside my bank subscribe for this curb blade this three star curve by the way and let's take out a moon's eye tome all right this is gonna give us bro hello why is this in my um base get, get it out right, get out of here please and now let's just read the moon's eye tome and it says the unending ba 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 boom plus 99 knowledge the reason for this guys is i'm not gonna lie to you guys we we used um <laughs> that mantra reroll shrine too much that we actually wouldn't have been able to shrine of order without <laughs> without using a moon's eye tome and we still don't have all the mantras we want because the reason i say this build is very min max is because you need to get every single mantra that you're missing before you shrine of order and we shrine of order at like level like 11 so we're three levels away and we're missing like three mantras so that's why i had to take out the moon's eye tome uh for this progression right i had to but anyways let's go ahead and um go back to the deep shrine and get lightning cloak i think lightning cloak is definitely what i want right now all right guys we're at the shrine let's talk to you i wish to engage in a deal get rid of storm blades and give us give me either grand javelin Ugh, bro it's not giving me nothing bro okay Let's just keep re-rolling till we get what we want, guys. Oh my god, I got Lightning Cloak. Okay, there we go. Lightning Cloak on five. So, Lightning Cloak is actually going to be, um, like my power-up mantra when Gon really uses all his, uh, Nen. Ugh, let me check if it's called Hockey or Nen. Okay, it's called Nen. Yeah, so that's like his little, like, power-up. His, like, when he's losing, he pops Lightning Cloak as, like, his final stand, you know? So, let's go back to the Void Eye. Let's recall this real quick. Alright, there we go. And now, let's call it Nen. Nen, there we go and boom all right all right guys well we're level eight let's go ahead and do some bounties so we can actually level up okay because we still need to get 80 strength for a sky shower kick all right guys i have a couple bounties um at the viper's jaw let me teleport to this guy so he doesn't log on me and let's do rock oh yeah these guys are cooked bruh okay there's three of them oh my god he's hitting his friend okay yeah, it's it's a band of like three people let me teleport this guy so he doesn't log on us right because i do not want these guys logging for me because they're all all three of them are my bounties and i want i want every single one so there's one heavy weapon dude this guy is just like doing the most damage out of <laughs> literally all of them because dude that that mantra hurts especially like when you're a freshie it hurts so let's do here let's do this let's do discovery of fire why why is it not working hello okay there we go discovery of fire it didn't it didn't proc for some reason but we just teleported the bro let's use our nen I know we're not like low right now, but we, we use some of it, you know, so let's just attack these guys real quick boom and This guy is like an ultimate seller. He's about to put his friend on fire Let's just do this real quick. We put his friend on fire 
And as long as we stop them from picking him up. No! Get away from him! And he's he's cooked. That guy's about to burn. Did he burn? Yep, he burnt. And let's put this guy on fire too. We can just press here. Um, we can't put people that are knocked on fire. But as long as there's someone next to us, then we'll be fine. So let's parry his attack. Let's do this. And now he's on fire. And our Nen is actually lasting us such a long time. And we don't have to worry about people that's on the ground either. Because we can just burn them to death just like that. Since we have um, a Discovery of Fire. So it is such like... It's such a nice perk of having this, bro. It really is nice. So, okay. That's three bounties. We actually just got a ton of stuff from that. Oh, even an enchant. Alchemist. Alchemist helm with a uh, stench, bro. Oh, wait. Are they spinning back? Oh, my God. All, all three of them just spun back. Here. <laughs> um, okay. Here, let's just do this. We put two of them on fire. Let's do rock. Okay. And let's just focus on defeating them. It's still... Bro, it's literally all three of them spun back. The edge moggers, bruh. So, I think... Let's transform to you. I mean, teleport to you. Boom! Oh, yeah. You guys are cooked. And we are a Nen back up as well. Like... Oh, he just did the same thing that caused them to lose last time. We'll put this guy on fire. Now he's going to get sent to the depths. We'll rock you. And he's not going to pick up his friend. This guy will, but it might be too late. Come on. Oh, no. It wasn't too late. Here, let's just do discovery of fire again. Uh, let's just parry these guys real quick. Bro, get off me. Here. Oh. I mean, that works, but... Ah! Okay, there we go. We put them on fire. And they learned this time. They're actually picking up their friends now. But this guy's still on fire. Nice. He just burnt to death. Oh my god, these guys are... These guys are getting cooked. These guys are actually getting cooked by Discovery of Fire. And then we can just do this mid-combo. We can do a little rock. Bah! Oh, oh, you're cooked. We can teleport to you like that. And our Nen just makes us a thousand times stronger, bro. And yeah, GG. I, I think I'm going to end him. I'm, I'm going to end his his uh, life with literally just this. And boom. I didn't even have to touch, bro. The flames did it. He said, why? Bro, you're the one that spun back the second time. I Oh, he has Phoenix Impact. You just killed all my friends. Why, though? Oh, he's not even attacking me no more. He's just, he's just like looking at me in my eyes. Saying, why did you kill all my friends? Why'd you do that? Bro, you? I said, you spun back the second time. Like, they did not need to get into gripped again. You spun back the second time. This isn't, this isn't a me issue. This is a you issue, buddy. Okay? I, I, I only needed one grip from each three of you. And I got that. And then you guys spun back again. Don't, don't make me look like the bad guy. Okay? I'm not the bad guy. I'm just a void walker. He said, it was so confusing. My friend thought you were, well, I was. I was, and then I won, and then it was over, you know? Also, why are my eyebrows so bushy in comparison to... He doesn't even have eyebrows. He said, my bad, OG. I'm gonna say my bad all. It's all right, bruh. Oh, he has mushroom soup. Thank you. Bruh, I've been starving. Oh, this guy has another mushroom soup. I feel bad robbing their corpses of the mushroom soup, but um, it has to be done, okay? All right, there we go. Uh, we can definitely level up now, so let's just use our dumbbell, guys. Okay, just one more strength, and then we'll level up. And there we go. We also got a mantra hand as well here. So that's about to be good, I think. Let's get Showstopper. We're starting to get all the really good strength talents since we got above 40 strength. So let's get Unwavering Resolve. That's amazing talent. Every boat needs that low key. And oh my God, we got Grand Javelin. Oh my God. Yes, we got Grand Javelin. Perfect. All right, let's keep going into Vitality. All right, guys, now that we got Grand Javelin, let's go inside the guild base real quick. And let's recall this mantra real fast. There we go. We recalled it. Let's put it on the campfire. And uh, not the campfire, the mantra table. Let's say Scissors. Oh no, this is not scissors, this is paper. Oops. I'm a little, um, I'm a little special, okay? There we go. We now have paper, boys. Ah, just like the anime, okay? Just like it. Alrighty then. We're level 9. Let's go back to the Void Eye. There we go. Uh, what did I just encounter here? Alright, anyways. Uh, let's just go ahead and find some more bounties so we can actually level up a couple more times so let's do some bounties guys all right guys i have a couple bounties at io video so let's just attack low bro real quick oh there's actually two of them so let me do discovery of fire it has a little bit of a long cooldown I, I i thought you could just spam it to be honest but it's fine pretty useful let's do paper let's activate some nen as well so we can actually um hold them off is this guy trying to heal nope we, we literally just teleport to him so he can't heal. It's actually super, super nice. Oh my god, he has so much damage. But rock! Oh yeah. Oh yeah, buddy, you're cooked. 
guys, I can't wait so I can show you guys why we have the transform mantra. Why we have um, oh my my health. Oh my god, I need to hit them now so my Nen doesn't uh, deactivate. Bro, Lightning Cloak is really like Nen. I'm not gonna lie, it's like a. <gasps> Bro, it's so similar. And also, get out of here. We hit him with the paper. This guy's trying to heal, of course. Just like last time. Let's help with the bro. Uh, our ether is running out a little, but we still have Nen, so we're super powerful. Oh my god, bro. This progression is so fun. And these guys just getting pieced. You thought you could hit me from the back? Oh. Oh. My health. Like, hello? Spit. Bro, I just don't get where my um health goes. I really don't. He's gave me a damage buff. So I'm going to use that against him right now. Oh, we hit both of them. Okay, okay. Let's parry. Okay. Rock. And he's knocked. And now we set him on fire. There we go. And now his friend has to pick him up. And because he has to pick him up, he's going to get some free hits. I'm going to get some free hits off on him. Boom. And he's cooked. Oh, my God. Maybe I should get... Bro, maybe I should get Discovery of Fire in every single progression. Because it is genuinely super nice to not have to worry about, like... Oh, what if they have, um... What if they have that one talent where Imperial Slumber, where they'll get up. Not only I only have to worry about Phoenix Flames, which as long as I don't do it to a fire user, I'm fine. Like, these guys just got cooked so hard. I, this, bro, Discovery Fire is so nice. And he had a ton of stuff too, so I'm going to take all of this so we can sell it for notes. I'm looking for the Verdiant Sniper Somatic, uh, just for the Gone Drip. Because you can equip you can equip that somatic at level 10. And we're about to be level 10 like in one second, right? So let me just loot all this stuff real quick. There we go. And okay, we can definitely level up now since we just did two bounties. So let me use my dumbbell, guys. And let's just get uh, a level up real quick. Up, oh, this guy decided. Who? Who are you? Okay, anyways, guys. Uh, now that he's gone. Does he have the Verdant Sniper? No, he doesn't. Let me use my dumbbell real quick. So we can actually level up. All right, guys. Um, I leveled up. So let's see what we actually got. Okay, we got Return Dark Gages. Let's burn that. Let's get Anxious Guard instead. That's really good for Fist Styles, obviously, since you're always hitting their block. We also got Padded Armor. Let's get that so we're not so squishy since we are level 10 right now. And finally, let's get Shield Breaker. It's pretty good since we're Fist Style, right? And as for these mantras, mm, we don't actually want any of these. Only because the only mantra we're actually missing is uh, Sky Shower Kick. So, um, yeah. I'll take a mantra for now, just so I can reroll it later. So I'll take firing line, but I'm going to put it like in my inventory right now since that is not a going move, bruh. And finally, let's max out our vitality. There we go. Uh, one thing I want to do, guys, is let's go to the other luminate real quick. And let's go to Summer Isles and farm for a Verdiant Sniper Somatic. Just so we can get the, go the going drip. Plus, also, not so squishy, right? Because I really want to make ourselves look more like the anime character. So, since we're level 10 and we can actually equip that armor, let's start sailing there. Alright guys, we're in the Illuminate. Uh, let's start sailing to Summer Isles. I'm not entirely too sure how to get Summer Isle chests, but we'll, we'll figure it out. Because I, I I don't farm Summer Isles for the life of me. Alright guys, we're at um, Summer Isles for real this time. Um, okay, time to do some vents. And hopefully I'm not here farming for the somatic for the pet next like two hours because that'd be pretty miserable. So I'm hoping we get it on like the first five chests. But knowing my luck, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, we're probably gonna be here for quite a bit. So I mean there's a nomad event right here. So I mean I can just quickly do this one. But the server sucks. It's unknown region. Why'd pick this one? Okay, I can just set bro on fire. There we go. Now I don't have to grip him. And we can just complete the uh, event this way. And hopefully get it done pretty fast. I think I'm supposed to be helping out the nomads. I, I I actually think I'm supposed to be defeating the Minitresa people, to be honest. But I don't, I think as long as I help one side, the vent is finished. Yeah, your actions please the ministry. Let's do this. And oh my god, this is gonna take forever. We got a single item from that chest. <gasps> oh jeez. All right, well let's get to grinding. Actually, guys, I just asked um, Deep Book and Info if there is any preset chests, like chests that are always spawned no matter what. And they said there's one in the hotel, Broken Castle basement, wherever that is. So let me go check. I think they mean here. No, they did not mean here. Let me let me go look for something that looks like a Broken Castle. If I remember, I think it's across here. Not entirely too sure. Or I think maybe I have to take that zip line. Yeah, I, I'm 99% sure the Broken Castle is over there. So let me just take the zip line. And let's see if we're right. Oh yeah, this definitely looks like a Broken Castle. And let's see how much if there's any chests here or if I got lied to. They said it was the basement, so I just had to look for it real quick. These guys won't hop off me though. Okay, let me just grip these guys real quick. Okay, there we go. Let me find this, bruh. 
Oh, it's right here. That's the bait. I genuinely never knew this existed. I've been playing Deep Woken for two years. I never knew there was a basement to this thing. Shout out to Deep Woken Info. There's actually, there's one chest here. Let's check. Okay, we didn't get it here. How about you? Oh my God, there's three chests here. Okay, guys, I'm just going to server hop here until I get the Verdant Sniper somatic from those chests. Bro, I've been playing Deep Woken for two years and I never knew this area existed. I guess you, I guess you really learn something new every day. Oh my God. Oh my God. After, after server hopping for like 20 minutes. I got the Verdiant Sniper. Oh, let me put down a Chime Dwelling real quick. And let's craft this. Oh my god, we're about to become gone. Gone. Guys, forgive me. Forgive me for my sins when I say gone, bro. Like, I actually genuinely forgive me for my sins. Okay, let's talk to the Blacksmith. Let's learn the Verdiant Sniper. We need 100 notes, so let me go sell some stuff. Because we have a lot of junk, actually. Oh, we're getting bag off selling all of this, bro. I'm Mr. Money Mat Bags, bro. Okay, there we go. Let's go back to this guy. And let's... What are we missing? Oh, we're missing 10 cloth. All right, let's go to the void eye then. So we can buy the 10 cloth. Or actually, we can literally just go to some summer, summer aisles for the cloth, actually. Let me just do that. All right, we're here. Let's go find the cloth. Should be right here. Okay, there we go. Let's buy 10 of you. There we go. And now we can just use the summer aisles blacksmith. Let me go to the bro. I don't hear him doing ding, ding, ding. Because you usually can hear it across the map. But I don't hear that right now. So why is he not working? Why is bro out of commission? What? Did they remove the ding, ding, ding sound effect from Blacksmith? Guys, I'm not crazy. Blacksmith's used been like ding, 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 right? Maybe I am crazy. Let me know if you know what I mean, though. Anyways, Vernon Sniper, Craft, and oh boy, oh boy. Ah, <sighs> boy, oh boy. Where do I even begin? Gone, honey, my pookie bear. I have loved you ever since I laid my eyes upon you. We look dripped out, bro. All right, well, bet. Let's go ahead and do some bounties, boys. Now that we're dripped out in his drip, bruh. All right, guys. I have a couple bounties at Summer Isles. Let's drop down. Let's help the bro. And let's do paper. Bah. Okay, guys. We have like three bounties here. So I'm going to be quick with this guy until his friends come. Because, look, you guys can see like his friends coming in like ants right now uh, over there. What? Bro, we have Bulldozer. And Bulldozer, Bulldozer Dame Proc just now. Hello? Also, does his friends not see him getting attacked right now? Okay, I'm going to use my Nen, okay? Um, let's teleport the bro. Oh, get away from me. Oh, okay. Yeah, his friends are stepping in. I want to try to knock this guy as soon as possible. Because I know he's probably low. Boom. Oh, he parried that. Paper. Yeah, buddy, you're not going anywhere. Okay? I just want to knock this guy because, bro, there's three people on us. And, oh, okay, let's parry this. Let's teleport to you. Brock. Oh, he's so knocked. Here, let's light him on fire. There we go. You know what? I just realized it's raining. Lighting bro on fire is not going to do nothing. I, I, I've come to a realization, right? Um, no. Come on, teleport. Bah, bah. And he's knocked. Perfect. Okay. Now his friends are trying to uh, save him. I can't. Okay, guys. I can't auto execute him with um, discovery of fire. Because, oh, they said super. Because it is raining. So I need to put him in like this log. And now we can use this. And now he's on fire. Ah, uh, no, he just can't put out a fire. Because it's still raining. Despite him being in the log, bro. Okay. It's fine. We're fine. Um, Let me just wait for my lightning cloak. And let me just hit this guy with the rock. Okay. I'm, I'm just trying to... I'm hoping it stops raining soon. Because once it stops raining, it's going to uh, relieve a lot of the pressure I have. Also, bro, tell me why this miner guy is helping me team up against this guy. And... Oh my god. Oh my god, so raps. Please. Please. It's so raps. And it's just stopped raining too. Oh, it's so raps. Okay, I need to go to bro. Or he's about to log. I lose my bounty. And this is all going to be for nothing. I'm not going to lie. Where are they? Where? Oh, wait. They didn't? They didn't run away with him? Why? Bro, he still... They still had him. Here, let's put him on fire. It stopped raining. Let's do this. Okay. Oh, he's cooked. He's cooked. He's cooked. He's, he's going to be put on fire. No, they saved him. I got knocked. Guys, I genuinely cannot refuse that I, I lost all my health in the span of three seconds there. So 
I'm spinning back. What the f Okay, we're back. Let's teleport to him. We're not taking that, bruh. We're not taking that. Boom. Okay. I've come back for the final time. And I'm gripping these guys because I'm not... Bro, I'm really not taking that. Five of them. Okay. I'm just going to hard focus this guy because he does genuinely like a bar for M1, bro. This is my last comeback. I promise. One and last. Boom. Yeah, he's getting cooked. Bro, it's like... I came back at half HP last time because I combat logged and I had to escape the depths. I had to do all that. Just... Oh my... Yeah, like... Like, I'm not taking that again. I'm really not. And he just got hit by that guy. Le he's still on fire. Let's do this as well. Now you're on double fire. I just don't get why the Silent Heart does so much health. I mean, it's so much... Uh, ugh, like, no way I'm hitting you. Um, And you just get, like, a free hit in. Oh my god, this guy's getting pieced. Here, let's do... No. Oh my... I'm playing so good. I'm playing so good, and it doesn't even matter, it feels. Because he hits me once, he gets the Monty Kati off, and say goodbye to my health. Like, really. Boom! Into rock! Into paper! Into teleport! Give me a teleport, baby! Nice! Oh. Okay, I thought, I thought they were aiming that for me. Oh my god. I think he's gonna... I just wanna get a spit off, and then I'll feel more comfy. Like... Oh my god, I just lagged. I, I thought that lag was about to be the death of me one more time. Okay, here. I want to get a spit. Oh my god, he's gripped. Okay, we'll put him on fire and we'll attack his friends while he's on fire. Oh my god. Oh, the comeback. The comeback. You know, it was looking grim the first the first two times. Um, the second, the second time is just tragic. I don't know why. I, keep, I, like, I thought they were going to log from the server. That's why I didn't even bother to heal the second time. But I came back. Dude, that guy got knocked instantly in comparison to the Silent Heart, bro. Here, we'll teleport back down to him. He gets pieced into the combo. Look, his his friend's body is here as a reminder of what of what went down, bro. <sighs> okay. Let's do... Oh, please. Please. Like, come on. I knew he would get hit by that. Okay. Teleport. There we go. Into paper. Uh, you guys ever heard? Wait, he didn't get gripped? I set you on fire. How, how'd you not get gripped? I set you on fire. Oh my god, he's flame. I, I Phoenix I Phoenix resurrected him. I'm I'm the smartest person on, on earth. Unironically. Dude, why am I so impatient? There we go. Okay, we'll see. Okay. Even though he's Silent Heart and he can't possibly be Flame and have Phoenix... Oh, he was too late. Uh, he was too late. And now this guy's only 40% HP since he got resurrected because I set him on fire. And Bulldozer didn't proc, but we're just bullying him now at this point. At this point, it's literally bullying, so... Um, brother, you're cooked. Come here. Turn around for me. Let's do paper. Bop! Into a teleport. Oh, yeah. Bro... Um, Metal Fake Out is definitely one of my favorite moves ever. No! No! Oh my god, I thought... I thought I got, um, sent back down. Here, let's set Bro on fire. Boom! The strong... He, um... He blocked the strong left, sadly. But it's fine. And he's cooked. Not making the same mistake I made last time. Let's just grip Bro. And finally. Finally, Bro. Like, genuinely, finally. Okay, let's level up. Let's get 80 strength, boys, now. And there's angels on me, so let me just keep running away from the angel. But, you know, it was looking a little tragic. The the second dude, the second time I swam back was actually genuinely tragic. I, I got knocked right away. Just purely because I was half HP and I had to make a 30-foot a fall from that height. But um, let's get 80 strength real quick. Hopefully, we get a mantra here. Uh, let me go to Mystic and tell Mystic I'm seeking physical mantras. I can't deconstruct the base where I'm seeing an enemy. So, um, okay, we'll go to Vo Void Eye instead. Let's lock strength. We're not in event investing into that anymore. And let's go to Mystic real quick. Mystic, give me physical mantras, please. I see physical mantras. There we go. All right. We'll use the weapon manual. There we go. And we didn't even get a mantra. Oh, boy. He said the tickle tackler always finds a way. You're weird. Okay, let's see what we get, guys. Um, Let's get herbivore. 
Okay. And then we'll get Steel Scales. Thank you. Now we're not so squishy, which we definitely need after that Silent Heart fight, bruh. And we'll also get Sunken Predator. Okay. And now for the trait. I'm losing Ether quite a bit, so I'm going to get your addition, boys. And there we go. All right. Um, We're going to have to get... So we're actually ready to Shrine of Order, but we need to get Sky Shower Kick before we do that. So... Um, what I'm going to do is let me teleport to someone that's that song seeker, do their bounty real quick, and then we'll go to Minatrisa and reroll our mantra until we get uh, Sky Shower Kick, boys. So there's some people here at, at song seeker. It's like a group of, a group of freshies. So this is about to be really easy. I feel bad low key, but we just need to get the grip so we don't get teleported out because I am very, very, very lazy. Oh my God, am I lagging so hard? No way, this dude, you just got up and you're already tapped. How are you up so fast? How, how is bro up so fast? Here, let's just set him on fire. He's gonna get knocked. Oh, you didn't get knocked? Okay, metal fake it. What? Where did your health come from? Like you were just knocked. And now it seems like you have 1,000 HP. And weren't you guys just fighting each other? Now you guys are both fighting me? Boys, I just want, I just, I just want to grip this one guy. So that I can, um, oh, he's not getting set on fire, bro. Whatever. Whatever, bruh. That dude's on fire now. Let's just make sure he doesn't get up. And then we can just grip this guy. So we'll do rock into paper. There we go. Let's drop this guy. And let's do our little flame thing. Now they're both on fire. And now, yeah, it should be wraps for both of them. Unless one is flame. So hopefully, yeah, they both got gripped. Do that. It's so nice having uh, Discovery of Fire to auto-grip people. It is genuinely like a, a quality of life I I needed, bro. So let's just finish this guy off. He is not he's not um, hard to beat at all. He just has a base sword in comparison to the max levels I've been fighting. This guy came back for another. Oh, boy. Here, let's just teleport the bro. Strong left. Paper. Bro, I, I bet you guys, the the third guy is going to come back. Like, hello? And now that guy's running. Okay. Here, we're going to do this. We're just going to teleport to him because I know he's he is a thousand percent low right now. Um, And I lost him. He's a thousand percent low right now. And I, I, I genuinely lost where he went. So, it looks like we're going to have to do a knock one of these guys for a health pack real quick. Because I'm not getting low out of... Guys, I know they're freshies, but keep in mind, I am literally level 10. So, um, let me just knock one for a health pack real quick. Bah! Oh, you're cooked. Oh, you're cooked. That did all your health and you know it. Oh, yeah. Oh, brother, you're cooked. And then the other guy got away, but I don't really care. You know, these guys spun for that guy. Let's see if he spins back for them as well. You know, let's see if bro honors the code. But we'll set that guy on fire. He'll get sent to depths now. And then... Bro, this guy is unironically pairing everything. <sighs> oh, no. Bro, that guy got put out of fire. Because he got put in the ocean. Uh, I'm getting stunned. Okay, let me get out of the water real quick. Let me put this guy back on here. Let's light him on fire once again so he can't get up. And hopefully he gets gripped here. Let's do critical into paper. Bop. Into teleport. And, okay, he's he steps now. He can't come back. Only person that can come back is the guy that ran away before. But by judging it, I don't think bro is spinning back. So, and this guy's just getting absolutely demolished. Oh, my God. That was a, that was a violation, like, out of anything, bro. Holy. Let's check their um, bags real quick. I doubt there's anything good. But, um, bro, that was a straight violation. 11 reds. Oh, don't mind if I do. All right, guys. Um, let's go to... Um, what's it called? Let's go to Minatrisa now. And go to the Deep Shrine to reroll our mantra. We're going to reroll Fire Line until we get Sky Shower Kick. That's what we want. So, uh, yeah. Let's do that, boys. And, bro, the guy that they saved didn't even spin back for them. Come on, man. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, that was close. I was all tabbed. I didn't even see the Whirlpool there. All right, guys. Let's go to uh, Minatrisa now. All right, Ram and Teresa, uh, let me just run to the shrine real quick. And we have 87 knowledge since we used the the little knowledge book, right? So we should be good on getting knowledge unless I'm severely unlucky and we just don't get it, right? Which I I, I hope that's not the case, please. 
because we still need $10 to actually Shrine of Order. Uh, we need to get one Agility, one Willpower, I mean one uh, Intelligence, and then we should be good to Shrine of Order as well once we get Sky Shower Kick. Alright guys, we're here. There's actually someone inside. Hopefully they're friendly because I'm in, I'm in California ping, so uh, I can't really fight that well in uh, 150 ping. Despite you guys are back comment, 150 ping, that's a dream for me. I usually play on 500 ping. Uh, let's talk to this shrine. Let's give rid of our firing line and hopefully we get Sky Shower Kick, boys. We did not get Sky Shower Kick, even though I said give me physical mantra. So, guys, let's just uh, keep rerolling until we get it. Hopefully we don't run out of knowledge, though. Bro, I'm down to 42 knowledge. I still haven't gotten it. What is going on? Where's my luck? I'm getting so scared. I'm at 17 knowledge. I still don't have it. I'm about to freak out, man. Let me, let me talk to Mystic one more time. Please, bro, please. No way I just used 80 knowledge just like that and still didn't get it. Like, I, I'm at 80 strength. It's, it's an 80 strength requirement, right? Here, let's pick Electric Car for now. Let, let's give Mystic a, 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 a word. <sighs> I have to defeat this guy first. Mystic, please. What mantras find me? I seek. Let's do physical mantras. Please, bro, please. I just used 80 knowledge on trying to get this one mantra. I still haven't gotten it. How? Miss, okay, Deep Shrine, please. Let's get rid of Electro Carve. Please give me Sky Shark Kick. Please. Please. Uh, uh, what in the world? Oh my god. Rapid Punches? Let's get rid of that. Is it going to give it to me now? Oh my god, we got it. Oh my god, we got it. But I'm down three knowledge. Okay, let's get Sky Shark Kick. All that matters is that we got it. Okay? Now we need to get three knowledge somehow. That is a really big issue, actually. So, this is what we're going to do. Let's go to our Illuminate now. Okay, I have a, I have a, I have a plan, boys. I have a plan. Bro, it's crazy. I, I had 80 knowledge. I only got it when I had 7 knowledge left. I need 10 knowledge to Shrine of Order. We're, we're going to have to do quests to get that knowledge back now. But it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's going according to plan. Trust, boys. All right, guys. We're in the Illuminate. Let me just go to Fort Mare real quick. Do that quest. Defeat a Red Sharko. And then we'll have enough to uh, do the Shrine. So, I'll just cut to when I do that. All right. Let's talk to her. I guess what's the deal? Ba ba ba. Okay. Let's do her quest now for the plus 2 knowledge. Okay. There we go. We finished it. Let's go report back to her. There we go. That's plus two knowledge. We still need one more. So let's go find our red Charco. There he is. And boom. Ten knowledge. Let's go to Shrine of Order now, boys. Let's just get one intelligence real quick and one agility. There we go. And now we're ready. All right, guys. We're here. Let's interact with the shrine very well. And this looks good to me. So let's do it. And boom. All right, guys. Sure you Shrine of Order. I think I'm going to end part one of the go and build there. Make sure you guys stay tuned for part two. If you like the video, then please like the video. And uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. And bye-bye, guys.